Today's question was, I'm too afraid to try a lot of things, and it's because I'm afraid of making a mistake. This is the Creative Crafters Podcast. Hi, I'm Bet from Bet's Makes, and this is your questions answered. Now, that is a big problem for a lot of people, being afraid not to make a mistake so they don't want to try new things. Well, the easiest way to get yourself to try new things is find a program or a craft or a workshop, such as our workshops, and get in there and just watch the video for some of the projects that we are doing. Take, for example, the one on quilling. So if you've never tried quilling before, here's a good way to give it a try with just scraps of paper and things that you can use to put on a piece of paper or a card. What we do with those instructions is break it down step by step so you could do it a little bit at a time. Now, quilling is just one idea. You may think, okay, I want to try something that's layered. Find a simple project where they take you step by step through all the layers and all the different things that the presenter is doing in order to get those layers correct. If you want to try UV resin, Take a look at our workshops in the uh, Valentine workshop this year and you will find an easy way to use paper, a piece of plastic and the UV resin and give it a try that way. Try it with materials that you don't care if you are wasting them and when you have success with it, then try it with the more expensive materials. I always believe in recycling, using what you have on hand. Use newspapers, use old books. Anything you can get your hands on can be used for a craft and substituted for some of the more expensive things that you see in a lot of videos. So I hope this helps a little bit. This has been the Creative Crafters Podcast and your questions answered.